Hey there, bug watchers. Welcome back to BuggyBot Plays Blood Bowl 2. Today, queuing up a Big Brother program here, which is doing pretty great. I'm getting really excited about Nurgle coming up pretty soon. Coming out, what, Tuesday next week? Jeez, I'm not actually sure. It's gotta be, I know it's pretty soon, it's like the 22nd. How so, just a few days left, guys. It ought to be pretty cool. So, what have we got going on here? Um, we lost a Skink, we lost a Saurus last game, and we're down another one. So it looks like we're down to 11 players. That's not very good for us, but uh, we will find a way to pull through. I know little Juby here got himself Sprint, which is really good. It essentially gives him one more movement, and with Sure Feet, he becomes even better. Um, we get him probably Sidestep next, followed by Sure Feet, and he becomes a very viable one-turner. Uh, Troubled Youth obviously needs a level here, and we'll, we need to replace one more guy. I don't remember if we have the full complement of... Yeah, we have the full complement of Sauruses, but we really need a new Skink. Someone to someone to basically stick around to those places we really don't want people. Um, boy, if we could get Troubled Youth a couple of touchdowns, that would be really good. We need another diving tackler. Ew. 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 I don't like it at all. I don't like any of this. I don't like any of this. All right, four re-rolls, a couple of guys. How, how well are they doing? Uh, it's not gonna tell me, just name. <laughs> name, name, name. Oh, there we go. Let's see, how are they doing in, uh, they're not doing great, so maybe we have a pretty solid chance here. Um, jeez. Buy ourselves one of them. I don't like the claws. If I can get rid of this guy somehow, get myself a way to actually take this guy down, it would be very helpful. I hope you've raised enough of them. I know I have. Now let's play. Oh, let's see. We've still got so many Sorai that are just waiting for a level up. They're really close, but they haven't got it. It's, it's killing me. It's killing me. Hopefully that changes soon. We need we need some Sorai to to, to get to get to work here. Let's go first. Yeah, let's go first, see what we can do for damage. Hopefully we can hurt some people. His... The good news is, while his wolves are really developed, everyone else is a little bit undeveloped. Uh, his whites are doing okay, but the rest of these guys, not so much. He's really got only four major guys, four major players. Um... Let's see. You recently leveled. You also let's see, who's actually close? You're close. Keeps him safe is close to leveling. And I think that's actually about it. Yeah, no, no. Uh really cares is right there. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. You if you once you level up, you need to be tackle. You need to be a frenzy piece. And they're going to give me a free hit on one of these guys. That's kind of dangerous, actually. Um, very well. We'll work with what we got. We'll see who we can hit. You've got break tackle. You're close to a level, so you're going on the line. And... Where's my guard piece? Oh, no, he's out. That's right. That's actually kind of terrible. The guard piece being gone is, is not a good sign. Alright, well he doesn't have a whole lot of dodge, which is very good. And we can stick diving tackle on the appropriate pieces to keep him from doing anything too unpleasant. Uh, computer? I don't know what that server thing is, but I don't like, I don't like that start. Not a fan. Hello. View over. 
Okay, I'm really not liking this whole server thing. Is that is that him? Is it me? I I am unsure. Friends. Friends. Return. Do you miss the old days of playing the NAF ball? Not really. Huh, I don't know. I don't know why it's being so difficult here. It shouldn't be. I, I seem to be connected. Oh, you had to ask permission. Fill out a form and triplicate. These players have gotten so lucky. Ah, oh, boy, guys. I don't know what's going on, but it looks like it's going to give us trouble, and I'm not sure why. This may just be a... Oh, there's the kick. Alright. We need to watch these werewolves, because they can still surface from these. And we're going to have to be aware of that. This is fun. See about knocking some of these guys down. That'll do it. Um, you, why don't you go ahead and take a swipe at him, see what we can do. I'd really like him to get hurt. I don't expect to. But he doesn't have sidestep and it's keeping him off my ass for a little while. There we are. Now... How do I want to handle the rest of this? I'll put you over here. So that he can't get too much use out of his guard. And then I think we're going to... We're going to bonehead. That's just... Immediately what I should have fucking figured was going to happen. Okay. All right then. Let's see if we can get the ball up. Um, you. Why don't you? Why don't you go for it? You're kind of. You're kind of in need of it, of the uh, the points. Let's see what we can do with you. There. End turn. We're pretty well screened. We're not in too much danger. I feel like we're in a good spot here. And it looks like he's going to go for the claw on the, on the Rookiesaurus, of all things. That's an odd choice, if you ask me. Just Rookiesaurus right away seems odd, and I don't know why he chose to push. Because he didn't accomplish a lot with the push. Do I want to go for this guy? I don't know. Now, because of this fucking bonehead, he can actually break this line again. He's only got one dice at the moment, but he can definitely break it with a guard piece. Which will be a fucking pain in the ass, and it's just... It's infuriating. Yep, there's the knockdown. And like I said, that's, that's just because... This right here was an issue. This motherfucker, god damn it. Takes so little to throw a plan into utter shit. Alright. That is a dangerous proposition, friend. You are putting that guy next to a lot of mighty blow.
All right, he's really committed over here now. And... Undead do not shift sides well. I'm actually pretty tempted to just head this way. Uh, let's see. Punch my way into here. Pretty safe. I would have liked to have locked that guy up. Knock that guy down. Oh, very good. I reckon that's what he'd say if he could talk. Alright, um... Let's see. You come over to here. And you go to here. Hey, there we are. That's pretty good. Um, I think we're going to get a guy over to here. Or here. Where can I put him? I can put him here. Pretty good spot right there. The rest of these guys can make up a decent protection for him. I may have miscalculated that. This will work though. Please don't fall. Did not fall. We're cool. There's a good hit. Perfectly fine by me, because I can do this. There, lots of protection. He should be just fine. I've got the advantage here, and I'm starting to take I'm starting to win that bash game with a few with a knockout and a stun. That's pretty good. And his whole werewolf jumping back and forth is not actually an issue because I've got this guy here, this guy over here. I've, I've got the advantage in that case. And his dodge wolf is not, this isn't frightening to me. Like, I've got dodge and you've got no tackle. I can, I can keep this up. <laughs> this is, this is not a too difficult of a situation for me. It's one I can work with. Totally go for that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Totally go for that shit. There's a push. Um, put him, put him there so that when he, he is forced to step in again, he has to step up to my crocs. Thank you. You are now stuck on my Croxagore, which is not good for you, I assure you. Did not consider the sidestep in your frenzy, did you, buddy? Oh, he should not have put that there. Yeah, there's the damage. Kill me some people. Okay. Now, um, I kind of want this guy over here. No, I don't. Because if I fail that and he does that, yeah, it's all bad. Okay, we're just going to keep these guys as locked as possible. I'm really winning the lock war, which is really good. Yep, okay. But that's what a zombie's for, is to eat shit. I mean, the fact that my Mighty Blow is not hitting the right people is a good sign from him. Like, he's he's definitely playing it smart. Um, I think we're gonna, we're gonna try to break back this way in a second. So, let's put, a, let's put our boys up here. And... No. 
who do we hit? That's the question. I don't like taking too many one and nines here because sooner or later one's gonna fail and it's gonna fail bad. Uh, fortunately, none of these guys have mighty blow. This is a tough choice. This is a really tough choice. I think we're going to put this guy here. There we are. Perfect. And there we go. So now we've got our guys on a wall, very difficult to harm. Move, move. And now we've got options, even. He's let himself get pretty tied up in this bashing game in places that he shouldn't have. And it's it's starting to cost him now. Now, the problem is this guy is a mighty blow, and he's standing right next to a skink. I am terrified. That is a terrible idea. Because I will sidestep into places that will make that a red dice. And I will do so very happily. He's not respecting skink movement, and skink movement is dirty as hell. But I think he's gonna go for it. He needs a five. He's got like, what, a 40-something percent chance to, to succeed there? It's higher than I'd like. But even if he does, he has no recovery. I'm just gonna, and, and putting this guy here is so dangerous, because I'm gonna hit him now. I mean, yeah, I'm definitely going to go for him. I'm going to try to hurt him. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. That was really risky and just ridiculously so. There was no reason to do that to himself. There was no reason for that. He should not have done it, if you ask me. Oh, good, 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 good. Yeah, it looks like he's going for my Saurus, which he's a rookie Saurus. I don't want him to die because I like having Sorai, but we'll deal with it if we have to. Um, we're certainly plenty ahead to win this right now. We just need to keep it up. That is ridiculous, and I hope he's punished so heavily for it. Because even if he succeeds... And down you go. Yeah, that was not even... That was not a good play. All right. We're going to move our boy up, and we are going to scream the ever-loving bejesus out of this, preferably with Sorai. All right. You first. Let's do this because I like the idea of hurting him, but we didn't. You know what? particularly feel against the idea of hitting, of swinging at him again. There it is. That's a chance to kill a ghoul. And to KO. Don't want to give options to hit to hit those guys. It's not not typically good for you. Um Let's move this guy first.
And I think we're going to blitz with this guy in order to mark that. Because I really don't want that guy getting a chance to hurt me. Stay. I don't want this guy hitting, hitting skinks. That's the main reason for that, is I don't want skinks to be punched right now. Alright, now, what do we do from here? Um, well, it's tricky. Real tricky. I don't really want to set that. Honestly, I think we're going to go for this before anything else. And we'll see about the reroll just out of curiosity. That's fine. It happens, it sucks, but I would really... It's kind of okay. I shouldn't have rerolled it. I know I shouldn't have rerolled it, but we're halfway through the half, and we're in a pretty good position. I feel like we, we had the option. We're definitely going to have these guys go down, and that's fine. Honestly, I probably would have kept him here, just because I'd want this guy to have options. I mean, he's still got to pass around, so you may as well have taken the claws on it. Yeah, you're not getting anywhere good with that guy, unfortunately. I've, I've been pretty adamant about making sure you don't get any really great movements. And yeah, now he's just trying to hit skinks. Now he's just trying to punch skinks. Because he can't get a guy in there. That's so dangerous, especially with a ghoul. It's so dangerous indeed. Shouldn't be doing that. I don't think he's going to get what he wants out of this. I mean, sure. 28% foul? Totally should do that. That's worth it for my one Saurus and you're pretty much only block zombie. Yeah, let's do that. No, he's two guys got two block zombies. That is not an effective defense against a break tackle. And he's still going for these. Buddy, I know that eventually these are supposed to work. But that's not going to work against diving tackle. Thank you for trying though. So, switch sides, put these guys in between, how far can you reach? Not far enough. Okay. They're pretty safe. Stand you up. Stand you up. Awesome. Uh, which of these is safer? This right here is the safe move, so this is the one to take first. Kablooey. Works for me. Come on, break an armor and get me some points? Nope. You and you. Honestly, if I'm gonna mighty blow someone, I'd prefer it be him. So please break and die. That would be wonderful. Oh, 
possibly off his mortal coil. I love that. I love that saying. It's just it amuses me to no end. All right, and you um, disappear into the void. <laughs> There you go. Just disappear forever. Don't get hit. That's all I want from you. So we're going to completely own this first half, which means he's got to score quick for the second half, which skinks are better at scoring. Skinks are just better at scoring. Yeah, I don't like his odds here. They're not looking so good. Yeah, he's going to get the two die, which means he's going to get the two die here with the claws, and that part sucks. Unless he does that for reasons. He should have stayed here so he could have gotten two dice on this guy. With he's a hugger not having guard, it's a pretty big it's a pretty big advantage. And he's taking double freaking plays with skulls. Oh, but he gets it out of pure luck. Are you alive? Just KO'd. We're alright. We can we can totally survive community outreach getting KO'd. But this is just ridiculous. This is a bad idea all around. Alright. There's the knockdown. And the one die. Come on, give me a punishment. Give me a punishment in here. There's the punishment. And he re-rolls the punishment. That's totally worth re-rolling, I say. I find Oh! That is the second one to go down. I don't have cash to replace him. Let's see if we can get him back. Eh, now he's just kind of useless. Of course. That's just, just got him back, and of course he's dead. Every time. That guy just will not live. My god. Why can't I get armor breaks like that? Kill a man. There. And then that. I could block, I could block that, um, I think it's more important to do this. Okay, and he's just not punished at all for any of that. What an unfortunate series of events for me. Why don't I get these brutal freaking hits? He's got AV8, and my AV9 is the one that dies. Ugh. Disgusting. Disgusting. That is a one dice. Why are you taking one dice? There is no reason for this. You did not need to do it, and I'm furious he's not being punished at all for this shit. Like, his red dice and his one, his one die are horrible right now. And he is just not suffering for them. And he wants the Saurus Foul. Buddy, there's no reason for this. There really isn't. But I am two guys down. God. This is... So ridiculous. Ah, block is the thing. Good job, block. All right, stand you up. This 
still pretty safe. That'll work. There. Works for me. Any of these fouls would not be smart fouls. They're dangerous to him for reasons that don't need to happen. That goes into a one die. Oh my god, game, would you punish him for his shitty plays? And stop rewarding him for them. They're so bad. They are such bad plays. Oh, bad plays. So many bad plays. Punish him. Punish him for his shitty plays. So now this is a decent play. It's a 4+. plus. It gets him in there. That, that I don't mind. But or, It's a 2 dice all the way, and I don't mind it. But these down here? Fucking trash tier. Terrible moves. Good lord, I just stalled out this entire half, though. Um... Let's see. I would like... Who would I like to kill? Really, if I'm gonna hit someone and I want the Mighty Blow to work, it's gotta be this guy. So, Mighty Blow on him would be nice. No. And that's a touchdown. Alrighty. Getting places, getting places. Injured. You guys come back, good job. Two of his come back, disgusting. You disgusting filth. How dare you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So he's got a full team, and I don't. That sucks. doesn't have a one-turner. He's not an effective one. There we are. Defensive setup three. The back lines. And I'm sure he's gonna go for a foul because he hasn't been punished so far for like jack shit. Why would he be punished now? Why would he be punished now for terrible play? Going into the second half down uh, even on teams. Why would he be punished? He'd never be punished. He's never punished. That would be ridiculous. That's stupid. Every time. I don't know why you bothered doing that. Yeah, he's not set up for a one-turner. Could have been. This actually would have been a pretty good setup for a one-turner if he had not done what he's doing. I've been so obsessed about hitting my guys. He's just not a, he's not doing very smart things, guys. And I'm really annoyed that he's not getting punished for his really shitty plays. In fact, he's being actively rewarded like fucking crazy. That's fine. Problem is, this guy now gets pushed away no matter what. So, 
That's a thing. Yeah, you kind of made it weird, dude. Ah, oh, jeez. You can be alive. <sighs> We're fine. So now he goes for the stomp. Like, undoubtedly, he goes for the stomp. Which, if he's smart, he actually takes it either. He, he takes the better stomp, which could have been right here, but he didn't because I don't know. You're gonna go for it. I mean, you may as well go for 100, right? Oh, of course he's not sent off. He's never punished. Why would he ever be punished? Making one dice and red dice against the Crocs, killing him. Why would he ever be punished for any of this? That would require him to not suck. Just something, friends? Anything at all here? In my favor, that would be nice. Alright. A fucking uphill fight every step. Jesus. This is, this is frustrating. It has been an uphill fight the entire way. What the hell is... No, I don't want... Sarah, what, what the fuck is that? Okay. Guy's gotta go on the line. I know he's obsessed with that. So I'm probably just gonna put dudes on there. God damn it. It puts me down three guys and doesn't punish him at all for his shitty play. I'm just I'm frustrated by that. That's that's a terrible fucking system to, to have happen. All right, we need to keep him at the edges, or at least in a place where he can get away. As an agi four, he's kind of important that way. Uh, do this, or not agi four? Uh, as our break tackler is what I meant to say, which makes him into an agi four. He's just, he's just gonna spam it. Ugh, disgusting. He's just trying to spam the punching. I don't think he knows about anything else to do. He just spams the punching and hopes it works. And the sad part is, I think it might this game. It might be enough. Both of his blitzers are now held up in these guys. Which, hey, I mean, you're doing damage, so that, that works. Uh, this side is weaker. We need a kick skate. We really need a kicker. Not bad. Not bad. That actually is hard for him, and that's a really bad place for the ball for him. Because I can steal that. I can steal it pretty effectively, actually. Yeah, that's rough. Good, good. This brings his blockers away from us. That's really good. And there's the there's that guy not having block. Damn. That was unfortunate. But it's just a stun, so we're okay. Not a problem. We can handle it. Really? Are you just going to ham this? Because if you're just going to ham this, I'm going to run a dude in to pop the ball. I'm okay with that. That's fine. I like that idea. Yes. Go do that. That's the guy that needs to be taken care of in all of this right now. Excuse me. going to walk that way. 
now he's going to go for the ball without putting better protection on it. This is not protection. <laughs> These are skinks, man. These are skinks. They're a problem. They're kind of gigantic assholes in this regard. Okay, so my basic plan right now is just blitz this guy into him. And pop the ball if he doesn't pick it up. If he does pick it up, then we actually do something actually far more devious and monstrous. Uh, we take our Dodger guy here. Have him go absolutely apeshit. One, two, three, four. He's gonna have to make four dodges. But he's got dodge. And I can hit this. And then I do something dirty. And I mean, it's dirty, guys. It's fucking dirty. Wow, double GFI. That's right, bitch. I'll bet he rerolls it. He didn't reroll it. Okay. Um. All right. Let's stand you up, and let's do the dirty stuff. Not a wise place to end your turn on the board. I really hate this. Let's see if we can do it. There's Stunty doing a thing. Stunty doing a thing. Fucking dub one. He dub one did. He just had to not dub one it, and he fucking did. That was lucky as shit. Because if he had not rolled snake eyes, all of this would have succeeded, and that is actually just kind of turning it around, isn't it? No, you do not knock him down. He's not done. My god, if he hadn't done that, I just needed one more dodge. That's so frustrating. Dub ones. But then we got five ones in a row. Well, no, that's not, because there's four ones here. Dub ones here. That's a lot of ones right going on right there. God damn it. That was so incredibly unfortunate. This guy would have been out. That would have been a dead fucking dude. That would have been a ghoul off the pitch and me way back in this game. Don't know why you did that, because I have block. God damn it. This right here is just so frustrating, though. Now that's a good stomp. That's a stomp that should happen. But he's already blitzed, so that makes that harder. And he can't keep this guy here. You can't do this. Don't do this to yourself. Don't give me this opportunity. Because this is ridiculous. Just a stun. We're fine. Okay. This is pretty pretty ridiculously unlucky. And then wow, it's just it's disgusting all around. Okay. That was pretty unlucky for everybody. All right, I'm going to stand you up. We're going to move you to deal with this. And we're going to use you. Break tackle did a thing. Come on, don't one me. Yeah. Alright, where's my other side stepper? There you are. So that's what I'd have to do. Let's see how this goes first. Fantastic. Awesome. And we're in. 
like a streak of light. Yeah, it's a streak of something, Jim. Call it lightning. All right, we're gonna want this extra bit here to help knock this guy down. Fuck it, no, I'm not taking that. That's just too dangerous. All right, my sidesteppers are here, so I don't have to worry too much about that. But good lord, there have been a ton of skulls. Like, ridiculous numbers of skulls right now. Of course. I just can't get this to work. I really can't. He's going for a fucking foul. Game, would you punish him? Punish him just once for his st just stupid plays. Nope. Just cannot be punished. Will not, cannot, and will not be punished. I am so furious about that. Cannot and will not be punished. This entire thing has just been him doing shit like that all game. Taking them down every time. He is unstoppable. It is infuriating. God damn, he's just getting a shit ton of stuns. He's not even playing it smart. He's just freaking swinging wildly. This is not an effective defense against skinks. And somehow you still don't know that. It's the block doing a thing. Now they're both one dice. That's fine. And these are his fucking thoughts. This is what he thinks he should do. That's the shit he thinks he should do. Nothing. Alright, so we gotta stand him up. Actually, no, we don't. If he runs, we actually can, we can run him. That's even better. Dude, that was actually the worst possible decision. That was the worst decision! Oh my god, that was a terrible decision. I can get back there. This is not... Alright, so that's that's kind of a last resort. So let's stand you up first. Stand you up. Uh, move you out of the way. We are. You need to do this. Into that. Alrighty. Perfect. Nope, that didn't work. You must have rolled a one. Two. Uh, not worth the dodge. The break tackle there didn't work. If he had rolled a three, it was a three plus. So, you know, of course it was a two. <laughs> Of course I got a two, so... Sure, totally make that GFI for no reason. Because this guy has sidestep and it doesn't actually matter how you punch him, he's going to try and dodge it. Nope. That's the reroll too. I don't want him to be able to run this way very easily. So that's why I put my guy here. Of course he got it. Are you dead? Good job, troubled youth. Way to hold it together, pal. I believe in you. Alrighty. So this guy is in trouble. These guys are about to get up and solve that issue up there as best they can. Perfect. I like that a lot because it frees up some dudes. Now, 
Now we're lucky because all this skink punching has finally turned on us and it hasn't been so bad. And now he's gonna he's gonna commit to all this. He's go he's just committing to bashing and forgetting that he needs to score at some point to win this. And I'm gonna be all over his nuts. The attacker has an assist. And I'm okay with this. This is fine by this is fine by me right here. Buddy, sticking people on it doesn't stop it. Now what he can do is try to get five. He's got five, so he can go for the he can go for the hit, but he's already used the blitz, so this guy can't free himself. Better dodging out of the way rather than blocking the ball. No, Joe. Strike first, run later. That's always been my point. All right. So many bad decisions here. Stand you up, that's fine by me. And run you. I'd like to get you on the ball. Because you're actually pretty valuable there. We're going to run you to here. No, you have to dodge. That much is clear. That's fine. Uh, you can do it as well. You can blitz here. Do you have guard? You do not. You know what? Let's take that. No, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. These guys will be locked up here still, which I'm okay with. And you're going to there. Good luck, buddy. Of course we did. Let's go for it. Alright, we made it. Cool. into that position to keep him locked up. Alright. What are you going to do, buddy? You are running out of turns and you need to score and you have two guys on the ball who are going to reposition and get a better spot on the ball. Pretty easily. We knew it had to happen. It just finally happened. I need this guy to be punished. I really need him punished right now. And he didn't get punished. He took a one die, but still not punished. Just absolutely unpunishable. Good lord, that is frustrating. Shit. He's so focused on bashing, he's losing the game, and he's just still trying to punch. I just don't get this guy. He wants to blitz his way out. Always smiling, Jim. 
And now you've got a bad dodge, no matter what. And if you pull him away from these guys, these guys are going to swarm you. You can't do that. You just plain cannot do it. That's fine by me. I can step him around into a better position. Fantastic. Alrighty. And here he is punching this guy instead, because this is the guy that matters. Just so you know, folks, this is the dude that matters right here. That's the guy. Where is my... There's my block. Okay, so there's my block skink. That's the one I want to punch with. Um... Let's see how this goes. Dodge is used. Don't like the idea of trying again. So we're probably not going to. But do I have to because of... Maybe not. Dodge, and take the reroll for the hit. Still nothing. Follow. I just, come on game, come on! Are you kidding me with this shit? This guy does not deserve this crap. This was bullshit to the extreme. Every bit of that was a load of fucking crap. God damn it. That many dice and he stays up. Of course he does. I have block and everything. It just, he had to get those. He had to get those rolls. This guy's luck is absolutely fucking incredible. Can he even score? He can score, but he needs to get it down here now, and he has to make a passing play to make it work. He's got to get it around all these skinks and make the passing play. Ugh. Of course he got taken out. At least it wasn't anything damaging. No, dude, that's a terrible play. That is a terrible fucking play, and I will get on you. That is a shit play, and you should not do it. Of course he does. Of course he does. That's the play he makes. That's the fucking play. Of course he does. He's gonna throw it to the fucking zombie. He's gonna hand off to the zombie, and then pass it to this guy. Are you fucking kidding me? This was your plan. This was his fucking plan. Good. You deserve to fail. You deserve to fail for doing stupid things. Oh, goodness, you disgust me. Alright. Time to respond. Let's get a sidestepper on the ball before anything else. Just because doing so really makes it hard for him to respond to anything else. Break tackle does a thing, very good. And now we see about stealing the ball from him. Um, do I actually see about stealing the ball, or do I see about just securing it? 
Probably stealing. I mean, come this far, right? could do like four dodges to go and get this ball so fuck it let's see what happens there's the dodge already used nope we're out uh we get out and he fails we're on the second to last turn let's go ahead and use it this is fine we'll just get away if we can He can still make this happen, but it's very unlikely now, because he has to do a lot of rolls to make it happen. And he can't clear the ball efficiently. Especially with a sidestepper on it, it's going to be really hard. What a frustrating game! Like not ne no serious punishment to this guy, none at all. I, I had to I had to fight it uphill pretty much the entire way, and he suffered nothing at all in doing so. Here's the question: Do I let him control the balance? Mm, I don't like it. I don't like the idea. He's got to make the pickup with no, no solid way to. That was the wrong way. He should have He should have popped the ball. That was the wrong way to do this. He needed to pop the ball. So now the question is, do I pop the ball? Yes, do something fucking that stupid, because you still have to make a throw. Please, try to dodge this guy. Fucking diving tackler. And he naturally does. This guy is unstoppable. But he can't score now, because you can't throw on a blitz. So, we win. He fucked himself. For no reason. For no fucking reason. So finally punished for his just terrible plays. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I could make a touchdown. So let's see about making a touchdown. Nope, we're not gonna make a touchdown. What an ugly game. I am... I am so angry. But I mean, at least overall we won. We still won. We fucking lost our big guy again. Like, am I sure he actually survives at any point on this game? Like, can we prove that he's real? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not convinced he's actually a big guy. Because good lord, that is twice in a row we've lost him. Um, I think we save up. He's 140k, we're only 20k away. But my god, we're down to 11 guys again. Ugh, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Um, woof. But how are we doing? We have 14 wins, one draw, zero losses. This team is kicking some ass. Way to go, Big Brother program. Crush them, crush them well. It's ridiculous. And you're very funny. Don't forget, coach. You need to maintain your home uh, I gotta say, these guys turn out to be quite expensive. These players are not cheap. And they are even my basic dudes are pretty expensive for what I want them to be. Boy, 
he was just so rarely punished. That was that was just terrible. But anyway, we won the game. That's what's important. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, feel free to leave a like. You can subscribe for more content every Monday through Friday. And I hope I see you guys in the next video.